Hi, it's some time ago. Um, having my second coffee of today. Did sleep so well last night. But um, I think like last time I've been filming was mostly of um, our getaway and uh, family visit to uh, Philip's uh, <coughs> parents and grandmother. We had some good time. We uh, had strolls around and Philip also went hiking and had a sauna and we went to the beach and had like those dips and went to a restaurant. So it was very nice. And uh, this week we've been like one week at home, just got some tickets for Mallorca, where we're going later too. Working, we have some new plans for House of K, we've also been organizing the new year. I always feel like September is another start or beginning of the year, so um, yeah. Lots of things as well, we had scenes and stuff. And yeah, I was thinking of filming like a little um, everyday, new everyday makeup look. So I'll do that now. The cleanser still clinic for it. And then uh, during the summer, I've been using either Nivea or uh, the kids with SPF, this one is almost finished. Um, this one is very like uh, food and nutritious, nutri <laughs> something like that, or hydrating. Um, I truly love, and then um, some eye serum. A scale of ordinary. And also using my vitamin C serum usually, both um, morning and evening, or daily makeup and evening uh, routine. <coughs> uh, and I think, so I you should have some coffee or just a large, like, get into my skin, all of my skincare. I'll wait a bit, but it's a good base or to start your makeup with always. Still using the Fit Me Maybelline uh, having the 105 natural ivory. Too Faced Bronzer, still my favorite. So they don't buy my brush. And then <coughs> usually like for a quick look or day look or easy look then I'm using the bronzer as well on my eyelids or eyes. And I must say that I'm using a bit more often like eyeshadow once in a while but um, for a quick day look then I'm just using a bronzer. And uh, concealer of Isadora, usually just here. Actually, I should have done that before my bronzer, or usually I'm doing that. Then, <coughs> using some setting powder already.
and this is one these are one of my the new makeup that I got um the brow revival from X Factor but I'm still saving the Maybelline brow mascara which I've been using during uh, spring and winter because I like the brush a bit more so but I'm, say, I'm also happy with this product or brow mascara extra black that's current um be using the bombing one of i think it was really as well before i was also happy with that like if you much like an open eye or oh but um now i must say i really prefer this one because it gives makes your uh, lash a bit thicker and i think also like darker because it's like the extra black so i think i in general prefer them um, more of them in as mascara so uh, if you see many other vlogs i'm trying to be a bit more like Minimalistic and um, like that I wanted to finish all the products or in general that I still had uh, because I really don't like to waste anything. <laughs> but um, so in general, I'm just changing like glosses or lipsticks that I still had, like kind of as a favorite. But with the lipstick for every day, look, I love to use my Tiro lipstick and still the Charlotte Hilbury of what is left of that. <laughs> but uh, that was more a bit of a nude. This is like very light nude, nude, a um, bit orange or coral. And as I said before, sometimes some days I use a bit more often some eyeshadow, like in general, it's like the brown and new colors that I had, or a shimmer, and also sometimes using the strobing stick, mostly here on the cheeks. And
an old it's more pink but it's a bit more neutral than i was fitting out with the uh, a pink one of uh oh yeah blushing rush but it's a bit like a bit brighter <laughs> or like um feller <laughs> it's cotton touch but it's um yeah a very like black brown and green so choosing a bit more for the more neutral or nude pink it's old one of hey man number one and um some emails this morning but i'm going to have a bit of time for myself I'm going to shop and mix with some errands but also just to have fun um in the city and uh, last week been working a lot and so we're off to Mallorca and I'm I'm actually looking for some bits um or coffee shoes I will show you hopefully later if I find it if I'm not find it I think I'm a bit too late to my ordering but um I will be fine, but it would be nice if I can just find a good or a nice pair extra. And yeah, I'll take you with me, film a bit, but I don't know how much. We'll see. When I, was, I think when I was on my way to the city center to get like some to find um, some like more comfortable like shoes or sandals or something, but I couldn't find anything, so <laughs> I didn't show anything. Um, but we're now packing, or yeah. I already organized everything earlier this week, but now we're. Um, I just wanted to show what I'm actually bringing with me. Not everything, but just part of it. Um. So we're soon off to Mallorca, and it's going to be like I don't know, like 30 degrees or something. I'm wearing my own of a sized. Uh, shirt vintage and then with these um i think i got these for a weekday um, um i will also bring this with me uh my lovely of now burning mouth shorts and so of combining it with um my blazer and a cos top or t-shirt black like shirt and with flip flops of course but yeah I probably will be top for a blazer but let's see and my weekday bathing suit um I will also be bringing house of case swimwear going to do a bit of house of okay there as well um then this like it has 
like nothing from it. The old one I got like before maybe like three years ago or something. So I have two of those. Also have one in black. And <laughs> this is an old t-shirt. Revenge. It's so good. But I'm going to wear it as a pyjama. And my mom shorts. Of Zara. And a one longer Zara. Um, dress. Uh, which I brought as well to P8. And also bring my uh, Zara sandals with me with a one with a small heel. This old um, slip longer Zara back. Not been wearing it so often. Old Zara bag. And um, I also bring this uh, cute skirt of uh, Urban Outfitters. I think I bought it a year ago. Um, I thought it would look cute either with flip flops or my sandals. And um, just a cost shirt. Um, makeup. Green, pink lipstick and actually also my Kiko um, pink eyeshadow and the rest is actually just my daily makeup which you have seen before so I'm not bringing that much or <laughs> for my well, I, yeah, it's just true. <laughs> and this is skincare. Uh, this is Gucci Body Lotion, which smells good as well. It's just for some self care as well, there. And Hawaiian Tropic. And I found these. Got some cleaning wipes. Left of cleansing because uh, yeah, for last trip, but I prefer to bring that instead of like all those bottles. <laughs> and and I found these as well. Um, it's for dry hair, like the Nay Shampoo Bar N A E, <laughs> which is vegan and a shampoo bar. And I actually also got this H&M, like a mini perfume, which I thought was like very humble <laughs> for, yeah, because I didn't want to bring my perfume bottles with me uh, for traveling or like in your handbag when you're um, working on the way. It's the, it's called Rue Kenye. Um, actually I'm just bringing two books with me. Thinking I am luggage as well. Don't know if I'm any country, but just two. Um, when we're waiting or something. Uh, both right away before. 